Hey everybody, my name is Chris. Welcome to Casual Fragrances. Hope you're having a great day. So, I'm going to go inside here to Macy's, KOP Mall again. I'm off Friday, so I'm going to smell some new fragrances. I heard the new XX John Barbados Artisan. It's called uh, Teal, T-E-A-L, 2022 release. I'm excited. I'm going to show you a picture of the bottle, tell you how much it costs, and if I like it, I'm going to spray it on my skin if I'm allowed to. Most times, they don't give me a problem. So, let's go inside and check it out. Okay guys, I'm back. So I sprayed it on my skin. You saw the video clip of the bottle and the box. So the note breakdown is lemon, rosemary in the top. The mid we have pink pepper, water lilies. And the base we have sea salty, driftwood and musk. It's been on my skin for about a good 10 minutes now. So the initial opening was very fresh. I kind of got a little bit of that Creed uh, Silver Mountain water vibe for a few minutes. Then it does settle down and I get more of a freshness in the fragrance. Honestly, guys, um, I hate to say this, this smells very, very close to Lee Saint Laurent YEDP. And I love that fragrance. It just didn't perform on my skin. I said it in my initial video, which I'll leave in a card here or down below. Um, I got like 20,000 views on that video. Um, it's It smells great. It just didn't perform on my skin. And I told people that before, people gave me criticism about it, but I said, look, every fragrance doesn't perform on your skin. It depends on your skin chemistry, your diet, so on and so forth, exercising, a lot of factors in a fragrance lasting on your skin. If you have dry skin, some people have oily skin. Nevertheless, it just smells so close to Lisa Laurent YEDP. I don't know if you should have both fragrances in your collection. Maybe if the Lisa Laurent YEDP, maybe your bottle ran out and you want to buy um, a different bottle design or the same juice. Okay. If you like the bottle, go ahead. I don't think it's, I don't know if you would want to buy if you had that fragrance because it's kind of redundant. But I, I like the way it smells. I don't have why uh, EDP no more by Lisa Laurent. But if I do decide to get that fragrance in, I probably would just buy the Artisan uh, artisan bottle and said You can get it for 75 bucks for 75 mil, which isn't bad. Or you can get a 4.2 ounce, 125 mil for 95 bucks. So it's under 100 bucks. You're paying the same pr price for why um edp anyway so it's up to you the bottle presentation is very beautiful in your hand if you are you a, if you're big about design and bottles it's definitely worth trying out yeah i would say it's about 95 percent close to least on the wrong y edp i won't say 100 percent because there are some notes in here that doesn't give it 100 percent. but it's so close i'm saying like i can smell them side by side if i had them on my wrist and be like okay why so and they're like other oh, my like why it's YEP. It, it's so close. It's hard to, to you know, you're picking hairs trying to figure out which one is is what. Unless you had the bottle in your hand, maybe your skin chemistry could tell one or the other, but I like it. I like the bottle. I'm not sure if it's worth buying a full bottle of it yet, ladies and gentlemen. You should go to your local Macy's and spray it on your skin, but right now I'm enjoying it. I will give you an updated part of the video when I get home, when I drive home, um, and let you know how I feel about the fragrance off of my skin. I'm back. Update here now of the new John Barbados. Uh, it's called Teal, a XX 2022 release. So, still on my skin. I sprayed it around three o'clock. It's going on now about, I would say, my phone says 2:15. So it's been on my skin for about two hours and 15 minutes. It's still there, kind of lightly on my skin. Still smell it like this. So I don't get get too close to it, but you see it's getting closer to the dry down of it. It smells like. Lisa Laurent YEDP. So if you smell that fragrance before, it's very similar to this one. I would say it's 90, 90, 90% close to it. You know, I just want to let you guys know, if you haven't smelled that fragrance, try to smell that fragrance before you smell this one so you get an idea of what this fragrance smells like. It's very fresh. Um, you get the sage. Sage is a very prominent fragrance, which I think sage is listed as a note. No, sage is not listed as a note, but you do get the sage in this fragrance. Um, you do get a bergamot feel, even though bergamot is listed, they list lemon instead. It's fresh. Um, you definitely pick up some must in the dry down. I don't really pick up that driftwood as much, maybe a little bit. But at the end of the day, people always want to know what does the fragrance smell like, what I compare it to. It smells like least in the wrong YEDP. Not a bad thing. Like I said, if you're new to fragrances and you don't know about YSO YEDP, definitely check it out. If you just want to get this new release of 2022 and you're not a frag head like me, then all by all means, check it out. The bottle looks amazing. They have two different sizes, the smaller size and the bigger size. Um, maybe I'll buy a bottle to do a full review on it um, because I don't have the EDP and that one didn't perform on me. This one's performing pretty good. 
so we'll see. It's probably hit this counter and it's probably towards the end of summer. So if you're not in a rush, definitely take your time. Macy's probably have another 50% off sale towards the fall and winter time. So definitely pick it up for next summer of 2023 to wear it. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys like my content, make sure you like the video. Subscribe to the channel and comment down below. I put out a lot of content on the channel and I don't get as much, I guess, recognition as a lot of other viewers do. Nothing against other buyers, but I've been putting a lot of work in five years now i'd like to get to 10k subscribers so if you like my content a little bit or somewhat you haven't subscribed click the rest subscribe button i really do appreciate it hope you guys stay safe in the world have a happy easter if you celebrate it or not peace